On December 15, 1927, 12-year-old Marion Parker was released early from her school in Los Angeles, California. A young man introducing himself as Mr. Cooper said Marion's father, Perry Parker, had been involved in a serious automobile accident. She was dismissed without any further questions. Marion Parker was reported missing later that afternoon. The following morning, the kidnapper demanded $1,500 and gave instructions on where to meet for Marion's safe return. On December 17th, Perry followed the kidnapper's instructions and arrived at the prearranged meeting spot. The kidnapper swiftly drove up beside Perry's car, brandishing a gun. Perry could see Marion in the front seat. He called out to her, but she didn't reply. Perry handed over the ransom. The kidnapper then sped off, shoving Marion's body out of his car. Perry rushed to help his daughter, but sadly, as Perry held her, he realized that Marion was already dead, and that was not all. Who killed Marion Parker? Find out in part two of our chilling tale of the murder of Marion Parker.